Welcome back, everyone. I'm Mike. And I'm Stephanie. And we're Van Life Sheldon's Travels. Sheldon, he's a little yellow belly slaughter turtle. He's hanging out in his tank this morning. But we're right here at Bob and Wanda's today in central Washington, around the Olympic area here. So, Olympia. And But today, it's sad day. We're actually leaving their little place and heading on to some more free camping to bring you guys with us. Yeah, it's been really great to be here. We got a lot of work done on the vans, and the van is road ready, ready to go. Yep. It's better than ever, so we're excited to get back on the road, but we've had such an amazing time being here and getting to know each other, and we've just really enjoyed it. We really want to say a huge thank you to Bob and Wanda for allowing us to boondock here, help us when we were actually, we did an oil change, we did a tune-up, Sorry about the banging in the background. They're building something over there. We did a spark, a, plug. spark plugs, an oil change, built a uh, skid plate, skid plate uh, from a flat piece of aluminum. We also got the air uh, tires aired up, all the batteries conditioned. Everything's good to go. So yeah. we're going to get out of here. As you can see, it's starting to rain. And we're going to figure out where we're going next. And we'll bring you guys with us. Have their cute little puppy here. Plenty of beautiful flowers here. But we're gonna get out of here, guys. Thank you so much for everything. They pretty much are. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna get out of here. Thank you very much, and we'll see you guys down the road. Yep. All righty. All righty. If you don't know, they have a place down in Arizona, and we might stop in and see them when we get down that way, guys, because you know, we're going to be heading, heading somewhere to warmer weather, and you're just going to have to hang out and figure out where that's going to be. So uh, we're going to get on the road. Thanks for having us. Greatly appreciate everything. Bob and Wanda here outside of their house has a really pretty little garden I thought I'd show you guys We're getting ready to head out of here we dumped our tank they have a dump station and all of that filled our water of course we were hooked into power here so lots of power they have a beautiful little home here not central Washington, I would call it. Notice we had some videos of us working here. Lots of pretty flowers. And we're parked over here inside so we can get electricity and level. But uh, we're going to be heading out of here, so we're going to load up and get on the road, guys. Well, here we go. Really nice being here. Bob and Wanda are super accommodating. Thanks again. Nope. It's quieter than it was before. Yeah, cutting the holes in it definitely helps. It's quieter than it was before. Thanks for everything. Absolutely, take care. Margaret McKinley 
campground. McKinney. McKinney. Margaret McKinney. There we go. Discovery pass required. Which we do have, and if you're new to that, it's a pass that you have in Washington State that allows you to use the the um, the camping facilities, certain campsites for thirty dollars a year. You have arrived. We'll check this out. All campers must register. We'll go see if we can find a spot and then we'll come back and register. Here's be a trail. And this is loop B. Really pretty back here. Yeah, very lush. Not much for the solar, but okay just tuned up the generator spot Some of these are equestrian reservation sites, kind of like the handicap sites at the uh, Lyle River Campground, or Liar River Campground. Uh, Lyle and they have little corrals for the, see the sign here, it says, Quest Reserved Reservation Campground, check in 2 p.m., check out 1. So those are reserved. Yeah, like if you have a horse trailer. Yeah. That's cool. Where we started. I'd rather not take one of the equestrian trails uh, loop C alright might as well hit them all this one says no horses in loop C Trail to the creek and some water. Reserved. Is that what it says? It does look like it's one of the reserved sites. That's fine. I wonder if that's 
Maybe, but this one seems to be an open spot. Right. We'll leave a little room between. C seven. Hmm. Hmm. So there was a couple open over there. Before it gets dark, I guess we should get to picking something. <laughs> we'll go back up here to loop A. Eh? Maybe we'll just take one up there. our site we're gonna stay in a2 looks nice well since it's getting dark guys let's get up here and get registered we're in slot a2 and I've got our discovery pass with us so let's go up here and sign in And just like at Lyre River, you fill out the little uh, register here, drop in the registration box. So you fill that out with your Discovery Pass information. And we'll show you more of this tomorrow, guys, when it's uh, a little bit brighter outside. So let's get it done. Well, guys, they didn't have uh, any of the uh, little registration forms, so we went over to the camp host. She was really nice. What was her name? Sarah. Sarah. And, uh, she gave us a registration form, and then I actually seen she had a big pile of them, so I was like, you know, we're going to walk right back to the box and put our information in there. So if you'd like me to take a stack over and put it back in the bag, I could do that for you. Yeah. So we're going to do that little favor for No her. problem. Yeah, no so, problem. So that's kind of fun. All right, guys. I know it's getting dark here, so we're going to get off this video in a minute. Steph's going to get the registration done, and we're going to settle in for the night. I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram. More content on Patreon. And as always, we'll see you in the next one. Have a good night, guys. Thanks so much for watching. And don't forget to hit that bell for the next video.